day one, part three of our adventure in Arizona. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and as always, subscribe to the channel. We're making our way back to the house and came across this huge bottle dump. There's tons of broken bottles out here. Some good ones. Looks like a baby food jar or something. We're gonna make our way through them a little and see if we can find any that aren't broken. Here's a good little bottle we found. It's intact. It's a tiny one. That one over there in Butler Valley is the neatest one I've found. It's been buried. They, uh, they buried it and then a wash come down through there and washed one whole end of it out. Oh, wow. Just put it in the back of his trunk and just see how many are still alive when you get back home. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, go through all this stuff. Okay. Our hits are We're trying to figure that. out the date of some of these bottles. We're thinking 60s. So we have some similar Pepsi bottles like this that we found. Like the late 60s. There's some really neat ones here. I wish these were whole, like this it says Sunrise Beverage, it's all engraved in there, it has a big S on it, this is a neat little cap, it says Gilbert, no Gilby's, Gilby's, I'll have to look that up. We're going around trying to find some whole bottles though, at least some of the cool looking ones that are engraved. Searching a little, just walking through the piles, trying to find any intact bottles. They said they know where another dump site is, just like this, that they're going to take us to later. And they said that one has a lot of whiskey bottles and whatnot, so that'll be cool to see. Cool. Was that Bassetti or what does it say? Uh, Nesbit. Oh, yeah, I can't. Nesbit. It's cursing. <laughs> <laughs> that is cool, though. Okay, we've been out exploring all day long over in those mountains and probably those mountains all over there. <laughs> and now we've headed this way and we're at our second bottle dump. This one's huge. There's way more bottles here. We're going to pick through them and see if we find anything that we might want to keep. We just found this little brown bottle that's intact. On the bottom it says Adolf's. Some kind of a number. Have to do a little bit more research on it. But I think we'll keep it and add it to the collection. Windex bottle. Oh, cool. oh a bottle? So in total today, we've probably gone around 25 or 30 miles on the off-road vehicle. We jumped around to various mines and those rocks that we were crawling around in. And we've made our way here. There are so many cans and bottles out here. I got a good one. Let's go see. Oh, that's a good one. What is it? It's a bell. Oops. 
It's not brake stuff, Andrew. Look, it has designs on it. I like the ones you like. Oh, that is cool. And, uh, but not only that, I found its twin. It's twin. Another bell here. This one's nice because it still has the cap on it. Yeah. Yeah, that's a pretty bottle. It's got designs all around the edges. This one has flowers on it. I think that's a different one. Don't, did, you kept that Windex bottle, right? You got it in your hand still? Right. We like these ones with designs. <laughs> We add them on our bottle shelf. Okay, I'll try to get you guys a good view. There we go. We just picked up this A&W root beer can. This will clean up really nicely in an acid wash. So we're gonna keep this one, bring it home and wash it. We just found this really nice intact green bottle. I like the ones that still have the lids on them. This is really cool. Kind of looks like a giant Christmas light. You could put a light up in there and use it as a decoration. <laughs> Thought I found the full can intact, but apparently they just wanted to open it a little more old fashioned. They didn't want to use the pull tab. I just pulled this up out of the dirt. It looked like it was two pieces, but they're still connected and the little can opener is still attached as well. It's all one piece. It took a little bit of a walk. <laughs> well, I found the good stuff. I had to go all the way to the end. The water washes it down there. I mean, it just it, yeah, the more, the more you go down there, flat underwater when it rains this whole thing's like just like a like a lake like a here. lake okay well i got i got some gifts for you so okay. we got this what do we got so open your hand you get, you watch you gotta get it in the camera okay so you, no you open your hand and okay the <laughs> so we got these with the keys in them right that's neat sardine cans tuna sandwich or something who knows with the keys <laughs> this is what you were talking about right yeah yeah Two of them back here I picked up. that's pretty cool i got these pretty cool wine bottles I looked them up, but just got pretty... some lettering on it. it looks yeah, like yeah, it does. It, oh, it, I was trying to read the bottom because it also has. Oh, those are. We'll neat. just post pictures online of both these. This one's but different. these ones with the designs on it. This is a Roma wine, and they have colored ones, and they got these clear ones with the white on it. But that's not what I found. That's really cool. Oh, that's not the. That's cool. not the cool find. It's in my pocket. Ugh. Those are just cool bottles. He found a pretty cool wine one too. Oh, did he? Yeah. And then we got <gasps> some milk that's glass what I with the lid on it. That's like a little lotion or makeup or something. Something, yeah. Wow. Yeah. This is good. Those are cool. I found some uh, dark blue glass out there, but it was all somebody shot it. Somebody went to town on it. So this is in good shape. Oh yeah. That's a pretty one. Yeah, that that's with good for the shelf. Lid. That's that's probably the. That's awesome. Oh, you got a good one too. Yeah, it's kind of the same shape and everything. Oh, this do. one's got really cool designs on it. Yeah, it's like a little, the like a little temple or something on it. Oh, uh, like some sort of bricks. Hacienda. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. This is great. This... Oh yeah, that's that's like a like oh. a uh, Noxzema. Yeah, like lotion or something. No. Yeah. Me or a little medicine bottle. There, I... Thank you for watching today's video. Next week we're going to be posting day two of our adventure in Arizona, so if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Thanks!